Venus, the second planet from the Sun, is often referred to as Earth's sister planet due to its similar size, mass, and composition. However, unlike Earth, Venus is a harsh and inhospitable world, with a surface temperature hot enough to melt lead, and an atmosphere that is thick with toxic gases. Given these extreme conditions, the question of whether there is life on Venus has long been a subject of research. For many years, scientists believed that the surface of Venus was too hostile to support life. With surface temperatures averaging around 864 degrees Fahrenheit, 462 degrees Celsius and an atmospheric pressure 90 times greater than that of Earth, the planet's environment is incredibly hostile to life as we know it. The presence of sulfuric acid clouds in the atmosphere only adds to the planet's inhospitable nature. Despite these challenges, recent discoveries have raised the possibility that microbial life may exist in the clouds of Venus, where the temperature and pressure are more moderate than on the planet's surface. In September 2020, astronomers announced the detection of a gas called phosphine in the atmosphere of Venus. This gas is often associated with living organisms, leading some researchers to speculate that it could be a possible sign of biological activity. The discovery of phosphine was made using the James Clerk Maxwell Telescope in Hawaii and the Atacama Large Millimeter Array in Chile. While the findings were initially met with skepticism, subsequent studies have supported the possibility of phosphine being a sign of life on Venus. Researchers have proposed that the phosphine could be produced by microbes living in the clouds of Venus, where the temperatures are more moderate and the pressure is similar to that of Earth's surface. However, other scientists remain cautious about this conclusion, pointing out that there could be other explanations for the presence of phosphine on Venus. For example, it is possible that the gas could be produced by chemical reactions between sulfuric acid and minerals in the planet's atmosphere. Despite the ongoing debate about the potential for life on Venus, there is no doubt that the planet remains an intriguing and important target for scientific research. In the coming years, a number of missions are planned to study the planet, including NASA's Veritas and Da Vinci Plus missions, which will explore the planet's surface and atmosphere in greater detail. Ultimately, the question of whether there is life on Venus may not be answered definitively for some time to come. However, the discovery of phosphine in the planet's atmosphere has opened up new avenues of research and raised the possibility that life may exist in unexpected places. Whether or not this is the case, the study of Venus remains a fascinating and important field of research for scientists and astronomers around the world. Thank you for watching the video. Please consider subscribing to the channel.